Welcome back everyone, this is a new episode of Pokemon XD Gale of Darkness. We will all be talking in quiet whisper episode, quiet whisper voices for this entire episode. Ignore no, my won't. failure of words there. Okay, apparently we won't. Riley backed out last minute, literally we after we started made this the plan. episode. We, we ne- spent I could the include entire the time, entire the entire conversation time before after this. the last episode, we were plotting out. I can we're include do like all an of that ASMR audio. episode. What, just <laughs> 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 I was going to be talking in whisper voices. He was going to only be talking like that. <laughs> so like and Riley just went seal. and ruined it. I mean, yeah, that's what you are sometimes. <laughs> okay, so let's so, uh, cut anyway. to the chase because we are... Yes. We're, we need to make progress. <laughs> Good. Man. We are 12 episodes in and we've made so little progress. I appreciate that you... Isn't this like episode 16? Oh, is it? We're, we're more than 12 episodes in. Yeah. How, how far into the game would you say we are? Um, barely scratching the surface. Oh. We should just do, like, six-hour live streams. I mean, that's what I do for some games. Yeah, I just realized I don't have... Six hours okay. to... Well, that's fine. Have you heard? Prototype XD... Uh, one's final adjustments are behind schedule at headquarters. Oh, uh, no. If they can get Crane to give up details about his purification study... All of XD1's problems should be solved in one fell swoop. I think so too, but he sound he's so, he's quite obstinate and tight-lipped about the whole thing. I heard Love Rita is getting licensed over this. Maybe after we've solved this, we can figure out how to scientifically give ourselves peripheral vision. What? A kid in the lab? Hold uh, still, yeah. uh, so we can catch you, kid. No. I refuse. What? Why? What? Oh, there's both of them? This is one of them? No. It's just going to be two double battles, I think. Okay, so so one of those guys is just standing there like, yep, my my business partner is fighting a ten-year-old who <laughs> broke into our lab. This is a normal day at work. It very well could be. We don't know their lives. I pity them if this is a normal day at work. Is that bird made of clouds? Yes. That is the best camouflage. <laughs> it's, it could it's a, be a cloud or a sheep. It's a its evolution is a dragon type. What is this one? Why not? Yeah. It's, it's a punching me bag. Asking questions. Oh, that's a terrible existence. <laughs> it um. I has, like this bird guy. It's cute. Yeah. This one, I wish I could have Swablu as I, on this team because um. Blue. Altaria is a good addition. This is like a little tiny bird friend. Yeah. Little tiny. Got them lots of freaking Tweety Bird feathers. Okay, come on, Doug. You can do it. Go, Doug! Go, how you know, Doug? Wait, did I replace my starter with a sheep? Yeah, I think so. <laughs> <laughs> Who is the starter? Uh, that... Jolteon. Jolteon. Right, okay. I remember that you got the thing, but I was just choosing the evolution. Because My starter... My, yeah, it went from Eevee to Jolteon. Corsola. Corsola? Uh, puffer fish. It's coral. I don't care. Coral doesn't have a face. <laughs> Neither do punching bags. <laughs> yeah? You know what does? <laughs> puffer fish. If I guess. Aha! Why not? Yeah, I mean, there are probably a number of reasons. Whoa, you've got ex- EXP points. And Marip used Thundershock. It's super <laughs> effective. Wow, I predicted that line. It's not like that's a line that appears a lot. Well, it's a water type. Does it just hop? Yeah. That's not... <laughs> I mean, I guess that makes sense if it's coral. I don't think it being coral makes sense to begin with, though. I mean, dude, they make Pokemon out of anything. Sure. There's literally an ice cream cone. Now, I have no problems with it. I actually am a fan of its design, just Mm -hmm. because it's cool looking. Yep. But also, 
It's an ice cream cone. You know what this makes me think of? Voltorb? No. What? What is that? It's literally just, it looks like a Pokeball. Uh, with a face. Oh, no, I, I'm not talking about Pokemon. I'm talking about the thing of, like, making Pokemon out of ice cream cones. Um, Webkins. Okay, what? So, allow me to explain. Do you know what animal that I am a fan of? There is not a Webkins version of... What? Uh, probably several, but the one in mind is a giant squid. Or at least, there was not when I had interest in them. Do you know what there already was a Webkins of? An octopus? At that time. Snowmen. Nani? You could have a Webkins snowman, but not a Webkins squid. Maybe they're a squid these days, I have no idea. I, I haven't kept up with them in about a decade. However... I personally am offended by that notion. Sure. Not my exact wording, but yeah. <laughs> I'm not good at battling, but now's the not the time to be telling you that what the fuck? Are you stupid? Now he's a scientist. He's wearing a lab coat and everything. Lab coat does not equal smart. Yes, it does. You're a liar. <laughs> I wear a lab coat sometimes, thus I couldn't be a liar. <laughs> you look a butterfly. That is a you moth. You look a that's a seagull, but the other one was a moth. Yeah, you're right. It looks like moth, man. <laughs> you look a sheep. Sheep. You look a seagull. Doug. Wait. Dustox doesn't have levitate. It's... Yes! Dustox. Huh? So, if it had levit... No! 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 I did not mean to select Dustox for that. Damn it. I used Thundershock on Dustox on accident. I meant to use that on Wingle instead. You should have been paying attention. God damn it. Use dig. <laughs> it did. did you see that? Yeah. It just sunk into the ground. The sheep? No, the dog. The dog. Okay. What? Yeah, Doug just sunk into the ground. Well, it's named the Doug, so like. Yeah, dug a hole. Dig Doug. That's another Pokemon, isn't it? No. What? I don't. That's know. a totally different game. Is it? Yes, Dig it's... Dug is a game. Wait, what's the evolu- wait, okay. What's the evolution of Diglett? D Doug Trio? That's stupid. <laughs> yeah, well it's three Diglets. Okay, what's what's the pre-evolution of Dig Doug? Uh, of, 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 <laughs> There's of, no pre-evolution of, of, of Diglett. Diglett's no? Diglett. <laughs> that, okay, I thought there was something. Yeah, no, there's not. <laughs> Dig Are you sure? <laughs> yeah, I'm sure. I... D D Google Dig Dug. I'm, no, I'm doing that. <laughs> it's, a, it's, a, it's a game for what? Like the... Oh, it was... It was like... It was like an arcade game. Maybe it was on the NES. I don't know. Probably wasn't on the NES. It was probably on, like, the Atari. Yeah, it's Dig Dug. Dig Dug. Ah, Dig Dug Pokemon. See? What? That's Dug Trio and Diglett. Okay, well now I'm confused. <laughs> <laughs> so, however, <laughs> this is telling me I am clearly not the first one to make yeah, this mistake. That's what I was about to say. That's not the first time someone has made that mistake, which is kind of fantastic. You know? It does sound like it should be the pre-evolution, doesn't it? It does. Okay. Or the evolution. Because Doug Trio is stupid. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna argue there, Doug Trio. Do you stupid. know what's more stupid? What? The Alolan <laughs> Doug Trio. I'll put that on screen. <laughs> Why do they just have wings? <laughs> That's their steel hair. That's like if they just put on those freaking if you touch like, it, you have bad luck. You, you know those glasses have like the nose and mustache attached? It's it's like they just put on those and they were like, yeah, we evolved. <laughs> By the way, editing Riley, please put an image of Doug Trio with all three of them wearing those glasses I just <laughs> talked about. Groucho Marx glasses? <laughs> sure, I don't know what that is. Is that what those are called? I think so, but I might be wrong. They have an ability called tangling hair? Yeah. Why? 
Do I get that ability? No, probably not. I mean, I just have Jewish hair. I mean, you just have that normally. Is that is that a thing I can say on YouTube? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I mean, it's accurate. I'm, yeah. It's, I don't it's, see any issue it's with like that. Genetics. Oh no. The dude who has Jewish family is actually being anti-Semitic. I don't know. I said a thing involving the word Jewish. For all I know, that causes controversy these days. Dude, if the, saying the word Jewish causes controversy, then I don't want to be on YouTube anymore. I, I would hope it doesn't, but it's, the world is a concerning place sometimes. Anyway, Mothman is about to attack you. Uh, he's an airbender, apparently. It attacked our beard. That's a problem. Um, oh, we're murdering a pinecone, too. <gasps> Sveal! Sveal! I'm a fan of that guy. I like Sveal. Yeah. It's, it's just one of them sorts always looks happy. Yeah, it evolves into a less happy-looking Pokemon, sadly. Uh, I mean, that's just accurate to life. Walrein. You know, you, you go around being a kid, and it's all just, yay! I'm a happy, bouncy walrus. And then you grow up, and you have to deal with your adult responsibilities. Right? Yeah, that's actually pretty accurate. Yeah. Why won't you die? That's a reference to a video. I should show you that sometime. The future editing Riley, please put an image of Sveal with one of them propeller beanies. <laughs> Sorry, go on. Who in one episode? Oh God. I mean that this is a rare opportunity. Are you saying you don't want to see Sveal in a propeller beanie? No, that's true. I want to see that. But, um, have you seen the, uh, you know about, um, what's it called? Uh, Oblivion? The Elder Scrolls Oblivion? Uh, so, there's this dude who does sketch comedy videos based around events from that game. They're fucking amazing. What is this person named? I honestly don't know. I will figure it out in between episodes, and I'll put a link to it in the description. Okay. To anyone who wants to figure that out, check the description, because, yeah. I could also make it an end card, but it's... I haven't done those in a while. Probably should go through to our videos and have the end cards. That would be a good one. Anyway, uh, so, so tell me more about this guy. Well, all it is is just one of the videos. It's uh, just the quote, Why won't you die? It just reminded me of this. I'll, I'll show it to you in between episodes. Okay, that's fair. I am noticing we are reaching the about time to be finishing the episode. Yep. Arc. So and This battle is taking for goddamn ever. Well, in fairness, this is two consecutive battles in the sky, at least. has four Pokemon. I don't remember how many of the yeah, last The other guy had. also had four. Okay, yeah. the Quillfish is, I think... Weak to ground type moves, so. Okay, now there's a pufferfish. Yeah, now that's a pufferfish. There you go. Doesn't have an evolution, and I think that's a sin. Um, wouldn't say a sin necessarily. It's one of the few Pokemon. Yeah, that but there's should... only there's only like seven sins. Like, if you have to choose everything wrong Sloth. in the world, I would not put Quillfish not having an evolution as being one of the seven major issues going on. You know. Yeah, I would say that's one of the. I, I would say that's one of the seven deadly sins. Okay. Well, uh, viewers, please leave your opinions in the comments. <laughs> oh, dude. Uh, d does uh, Quillfish not having an evolution count as one of the the seven deadly sins or not? Uh, if if you're religious and offended by the very notion of that remark, <laughs> yell at me on my other channel. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah, but like I don't know. That's probably not offensive. We're, we're having fun in this episode. Being <laughs> confused about whether or not we're being offensive. And all to do with religion. Yeah, isn't it's almost that almost as if religion is a topic to stay away from if you don't want to offend anyone. Yeah. Wait, is Seal also poisoned? Sveal. Sveal. Same thing. <laughs> uh, I don't know. That looks like his stomach isn't agreeing with him, though. 
What? It's on the screen. It looked like he freaking vomited dirt across the room. Oh, that is true. He did. See? <laughs> That's just accurate. Oh, that is like food poisoning or something, right? That is, yeah, bloodshot poisoning. Yeah, I mean, like... <gasps> no! Did you see its face? I didn't. It was tragic. I should start paying attention to this show. <laughs> I mean, dude, you're just... <gasps> what? You're just here to talk at me while I play a game. Is yep. the, the basis of this show. That's fair. I mean, we both enjoy it from what I've worn. Yeah, I've been fun. Whoa, did we victory? We victoried. Whoa, sheep, you saved the day. Nope, I'm just no good at battling. Oh, no. Don't... Don't be beat yourself too up. Harsh. I'll pretend Don't. I never saw you. Scram over... I mean... Sure, but like, that's just your responsibility. Oh, ah, there's an alarm! Nope, that's beard being poisoned. No. That's confusing. Would that make more sense if we had audio? Yeah, I think so. Okay, so we can't hear the game audio in case that was unclear. Oh, hey, it's time to end the episode. Yes, it is. I'm just curing us of poison. I don't know why, because... Okay, okay. Uh, we'll pause see right you next there. Try. Next time, but don't, I'm gonna go no, no, Don't move. Right there. You're in the doorway. That's a bad place to stand. Okay. Uh, good night.